All right, so we got how GTA 6 ends. Let's see how this video goes. Now, what does this mean? I know this is by Teaser Play. They make like, you know, all types of like concepts in the game, stuff like that. Is that Lucia? That's Lucia, and I guess the guy was Jason. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, bro, hold up. Wait, 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 wait. Do I gotta pick one? Uh, uh, uh. Wait, no, I didn't pick one yet. All right, now listen, I'm gonna be honest with you. Now, GTA 6 is literally... Well, let me just... Let me knock on wood. GTA 6 is, is around the corner. We all know 2024 has been going by as fast as, like, the Flash. I'm gonna just be honest with you. Now, if I'm being honest... Um, everybody's ready for GTA 6. Everybody. Now, I know we got Elden Ring coming up next month. We got a new Call of Duty uh, dropping. We got a new Call of Duty trailer dropping um, next month as well. A lot of things Xbox related dropping uh, next month as well. A, a lot, bro, a lot of things are happening in June. So, uh, you know, listen, I, let me give you guys a warning. If you guys see a lot of videos going up in June, bro, do not kill me, bro. That's the time where it, it, it's go time because I've been waiting for a lot of games to pop off and a lot of like trailers and stuff like that. So June will definitely be hectic. That's that's just my warning to you. Um, other than that, speaking of GTA 6, man, uh, we all know GTA, j just like the GTA franchise itself, um, there's a lot of plots. There's a lot of just twists and turns uh, and a lot of, you know, key decision making. The thing is, the beauty is, you know, if, if you make a decision right now, you can always, you know, play the whole story again and pick a different decision. Or you could just look it up on YouTube about, like, the other decisions as well, you know. And this kind of reminds me of, like, um, uh, GTA 5, you know. 10 years, bro, you know what's so crazy? GTA 5 was literally 10 years ago. I literally remember buying GTA 5 with my mom because, you know, I mean, let's be honest. Like, I got my idea and stuff like that. Like, bro, I don't, I don't, like, I don't, bro, let's, let's be honest, bro. I don't need to bring my mommy up to GameStop anymore. Like, bro, bro, when they, when they say, hey, bro, can I see your ID? Bro, I'm whipping my ID out fast as possible, bro. Like, just, just be honest. I will show, show you my ID right now, but that's a little, that's a little too much confidential. Bro, listen, when that guy says, um, well, sorry, sir, I'm going to need your ID. Yeah, I'm whipping it out. Yeah, there's no hesitation. I'm telling you. Like, 10 years ago, when I tried to buy GTA 5, bro, Oh my! I even, I didn't even know that they had like this like parent like this uh parental, um you know you have to have a parent like if you're young you have to have the parent to buy or whatever. Bro, like let me give you a little uh, story time, okay? Listen, you know I'm about to buy GTA Five, right? You know everything is all cope aesthetic. I'm excited. I worked hard for this money. You know I was doing all types of chores and everything. You know I I get to the guy. I'm like, yeah, you know why I'm here. <laughs> you know why I'm here. There's there's no, there's no there's no exception here. You know why I'm here. You know why everybody else is here too. Yeah, this is a, this is around where uh you know GTA Five dropped. So everybody and their mom was trying to buy the game in person because if you guys don't know, like yes you can buy it on like the PlayStation Store or whatever. But let's be honest, that thing took 20 years. So obviously a lot of people physically went to the GameStop and bought the game. In my opinion, that's just the best way to do it. So, like, whenever GTA 6 comes out, best believe, instead of actually buying the game, like, on the, on the console, whatever, on the PS5 or on the Xbox or whatever, brother, I'm buying the game in person. I don't care what you say. I'm buying GTA 6 in person. I feel like GTA 6 is going to be... I feel, like it, it, I feel like it's going to bring everybody out. That's what I think. I feel like GTA 6 is going to bring everybody out and people are going to be in long lines and stuff like that to get the most anticipated game ever. But let me get back to my story. Listen, GTA 5 is it, it's out. The, the whole the street is hot. The street is everybody and their mom is trying to get the game. Let me tell you something. I'm like, "Hey, you know why I'm here." <laughs> There's no explanation. You know why I'm here. Yep, yep. That stack of that stack of games right there. Yeah, I want one. Mhm. Mm I want one. Bro, when I tell you this guy was like, "Yeah, um so this game has six nudity, drugs, um, um, a murder, like, bro, he was naming everything, I'm like, bro, what is this guy doing, is he really betraying me right now, I thought we were, like, on the same team here, he's telling my mom all these things, you know, my mom, she looks over to me, I'm like, ma, like, it, it, the game is called Grand Theft Auto, like, what did you expect, like, this, this game isn't for the, it, this game isn't for the weak, like, I don't, I don't know why you, I don't know why you're looking at me, this game isn't for the weak, as a matter of fact, I want this game right now, okay, I didn't say that, but I was like, my, like, the game is called, it's called GTA 5, like, what is, it's called GTA, like, what do you, I'm sorry, but it, it, it got a girl in, 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 in her bra, in, 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 a, in a cover, like, 
you you know what I signed up for. Like I don't I don't even know what the what the discussion is. You know what we signed up for. I know I'm you know little or whatever. I think at this time I was what. Um, Oh, I was 10 years old. Okay, I can see why she looked at me. <laughs> but, like, she knew I wasn't, like, you know, uh, like, into the, you know, she knew I wasn't going to do anything, like, you know, malicious or nothing. So, of course, you know, I, I gave her my money. And, you know, I think she covered, like, the tax or whatever because they, they, he was like, oh, yeah. Um, So, I think I bought, like, $60, right? I was working hard for this. I bought, like, $60. I think it was, like, 67 I was like, oh, snap. But I think she paid for the rest of the seven or whatever. And man, oh man, I walked home. Oh man, I brought, I walked out that out that store just feeling accomplished. Like like I just like I just got gold from the Olympics. Like I bro, I'm bro, I'm guarding this game with my life, bro. <laughs> I'm guarding this game with my life, bro. I'm holding the game like this, bro, barricaded. It's not squeezing out. Let me do the, it's it's not coming out. I promise you. So get home. I play the game. Um like all night. I literally fell asleep, woke up. I didn't even take a shower, brush my teeth, didn't eat no food or nothing. Kept playing the game. Uh, so, yeah, and, and ever since then, I've played the game 10 more times. So, GTA Five definitely um, in my top three games for sure. I just cannot wait to GTA Six come out. And obviously, you know, guys, if you haven't seen already, uh, make sure you guys click that little button at the top of the screen now. That's when I reacted to the GTA 6 trailer that night. Yes, the game was supposed to drop literally the, in the uh, morning of December 5th. But then a hacker or a leaker or whatever, whatever that guy is, literally leaked the trailer on Twitter. So, you know, GTA, there was, I said GTA, Rockstar, they were literally forced to drop the trailer early. Bro, I thought, bro, I thought I saw a glitch. Like, bro, when I was on, the, like, bro, when I was on a home screen, whatever, because I think I just get, I, I think I just, <laughs> I think I just got done, like, uploading the video or whatever, right? It was, like, 6 p.m. Bro, I refreshed the page for some odd reason. Something just told me to refresh the page. It's 6.05. That thing said one minute ago, uh, GTA 6 trailer. I'm like, wait a minute, what? Bro, I clicked on, like, the Rockstar, you know, channel. Bro, I, I refreshed it a few times. I'm like, wait a minute, this is the actual channel. I click on a trailer, whatever. Brother, the like, the like meter, the like little count thing is bugged. The like count says like 500,000 likes in five minutes. I look at the comments. It, they're all like, let's go, let's go. This is actually it. Da, 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 da. I'm like, wait a minute, I thought it was gonna be released tomorrow. I go on Twitter. Rockstar is like, hey, um, yeah, somebody tried to leak the thing. Yeah, somebody leaked the thing on Twitter. Please go watch it on our channel i'm like oh wait a minute it's real so you know i get everything ready you know i'm, I'm scrambling and scrambling like some eggs i'm scrambling bro bro i, I launch up obs or whatever da, 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 and it's ready I, I, bro, I get the cameras ready everything is it's copacetic so even it listen even i understand that like the the whole leak was just terrible whatever i'm so glad that rockstar you know was able to get the max i'm well i wouldn't say max but i'm so uh, like glad that rockstar was able to like you know still get like you know yeah still able to still able to get the max you know viewership and support and just love that um that they got because yeah somebody leaked it on twitter or whatever and people were, were already watching it and uh the fact that they still was like you know what cool let's just let's just leak it out whatever let's just let it go and then they still got support after that. Shout out to Rockstar for all that. It, it, it must hurt. Like I said, I think I actually created the video responding to like the leaker or whatever. But um, like I said, it must hurt, bro, for people to spend a long time working on the trailer, working on the game for 10 years just for somebody to leak it on the night before the actual release date in the morning. That's crazy. That's absolutely crazy. So other than that, man, I, I'm, just, I'm just, listen, I'm just excited. This whole kill uh, Lucia, kill Jason thing, you guys don't know, uh, Lucia is like the main character, the uh, main protagonist. And I think Jason is the main protagonist uh, as well. So, um, listen, we don't know what, listen, I'm going to be honest with you. Um, in my opinion, a lot of people are, are <laughs> a lot of people are saying that the way GTA 6 is going to end is you're probably you're going to have to pick between Lucia or Jason, like one of them is gonna like turn their back on each other or whatever. Um, and in my opinion, I don't. Here's the thing, right? Because obviously it's gonna be like some type of like Bonnie and Clyde, you know, just just couple, just going crazy or whatever. Um, here's my thing. I think. I mean, this is in Vice City as well, so you know, it, it, it's it's gonna be hectic. Like it's it's not like in Los Santo. This is gonna be in Vice City. Um. In my opinion, I think I don't think it's gonna turn out like this. I think that 
I don't know, man. I, I think it, it might turn out like this to where, like, like one of them turn on each other. I feel like Jason, I, I think they might, they might make Jason turn on Lucia or whatever like that. And then, like, because I feel like Lucia is, like, the main, main, main protagonist. I feel like she's, like, the good guy no matter what. Well, okay, well, she's not the good guy. I mean, like, this girl, she's, like, she robs stuff and kills people. But I, I digress. To us, she's the good guy. Um, so we'll see. We'll see how it is. Um, they're most likely going to give us, like, an option to, like, kill off somebody or, um, or, or, or save both. Or probably, you know what I think? I think they're going to give us the death wish. Um, they're, they're probably going to give us that again, like, the death wish option again. And that might be, like, the canon option for it because um, I'm going to be honest with you. The way GTA did, like, uh, did the death wish for GTA V was absolutely perfect. You save all three characters. All, in my opinion, all three characters were, like, were really likable. So um, that was, like, the perfect canon ending. Um, I feel like I feel like the 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 worst choice was like killing Michael. I feel like that was the most that was the stupidest choice. Like, like why would you kill off Michael? I think Michael was just like, I mean Michael was more of like a, I don't want to say like a father, but like he was more of like a, yeah, that was like the father and son duo, Michael and Franklin. You know, so um, if anything, you, I mean Frank, not Franklin, sorry, Trevor was like the was like the odd one out. But I'm glad that the canon was, you know, you save all three, you take out everybody's enemies. And yeah, I love that. Other than that, man, comment down below. What do you guys think the GTA 6 trailer, uh, not trailer, what do you guys think the GTA <laughs> ending is going to be like? I'm just excited to play the game. I'm excited to play the game. I'm excited to cover this game from head to toe. We're going to be like, bro, let me tell you something. Let me just give you a heads up. When this game comes out next year, best believe, we're gonna, listen, we're covering this game from head to toe. Every decision, every cutscene, every every ounce of gameplay, we're covering this game from head to toe. Mark my words. Do you hear me? Mark my words. And, and, and it's up to you if you want to be there with me or not because, um, you know, we're growing and stuff like that. And like I said, we're not I'm. We, we're growing, you know, as a family or whatever you want to call us, a family, um, uh, a clan, an army. I don't know what to call us, but you know, I, I'll make up a name. <laughs> Other than that, comment down below. See you guys. Thanks for the out. And...